I'm a psychiatric doctor working in the NHS in South London. I work on the front line dealing with extreme mental health problems in A&E. Over the last few years I've been looking into new ways of treating mental health problems. The UK government is now funding my research, sending me further afield than ever before to the Amazon rainforest. I'm going to be looking into the controversial medicine ayahuasca. This psychedelic brew is used by the Shabibo tribe and I hope that this may hold some answers to helping people with mental health problems in the West. One of us is going to have to travel back with the iPads and stuff to Akitas, which is about a three hour journey, and then get the first round of data whilst the others are being yeah. potentially tested in the jungle. I met Simon 10 years ago, and ever since we've discussed the future of mental health and the role that psychedelics may have to play. Together, we've designed an experiment looking into the therapeutic applications of ayahuasca and how it could be used to treat childhood trauma. On the 5th of January, we're heading into the heart of the Amazon to live alongside an indigenous community and traditional healers. We'll be working at the Ayahuasca Foundation and Research Center. We believe that this experiment may provide data which could hold the key to solving many of the problems that we currently face in psychiatry. This needs to be documented. So we're flying out from Heathrow on the 5th, arriving to Lima on the 6th. We're going straight to Iquitos from there. Then we're gonna be going into the jungle up the Amazon River into the heart of the reserve, and we need to be ready to start testing people by the 11th. We've got to get all of our equipment on one of those tiny boats that the locals use and get them to take us directly to the tribe. I think this is an incredibly exciting time for psychiatry. Having said that, I definitely have some reservations about spending such a long amount of time in the jungle. The medicine they use is very different from our own, and I don't know what I'm going to find. I'm Tom Swindell, I'm a documentary filmmaker. I've been shooting for television broadcasts for 10 years as an observational filmmaker. I'm gonna follow Simon and Nigel as they travel down the River Amazon into the Ayahuasca Center and I'll film all of their setup. And then on the 20th of January, I'm gonna flip the camera background on myself and I'm actually gonna do a course in Ayahuasca that will last a whole entire month. It's gonna be intense and uh, I'm gonna be having a lot of inner visions uh, God knows what type of trauma is going to come up. The reason I'm doing it is because when I was eight years old, my brother, who was only ten years old at the time, passed away. He died, broke his neck on a rope swing in the back garden. Um, so that's always left me troubled ever since, really. I've had to carry that pain and that loneliness for the rest of my life. So I'd like to investigate that. And I'd also like to investigate this medical trial funded by the UK government into ayahuasca. If you're interested in this documentary and would like to help with the funding process, then please get in touch.